This build series is brought to you by Apex Cases and Seagate. Hi everybody, it's Brian for GadgetUnit.com and for part two of my PC build series, I'll be showing you an unboxing and overview of the Intel Core i3-3225 processor. This uses the LJ1155 socket and this runs at 3.3 gigahertz. It is a dual core processor, which is multi-threaded. So you have two physical cores and a total of four logical cores. Of course, this is an Ivy Bridge processor and it runs Intel's HD 4000 integrated GPU. So this will run you anywhere from about $130 to about $150, depending on where you shop. Now taking a quick look around the packaging, here is the right side, so this gives you some of the specs and features of the processor. On the side it just gives you some barcode information, some information in a number of other languages. And at the top we can see what the processor looks like. And let's go ahead and break the seal to get into the box. Of course I should have scissors handy, but I do not, so that will just make things take a little bit longer. But here we are going into the box right now. So inside of the box, we do get a little user installation manual, which also gives you information about the three year limited warranty. And you also have an Intel Core i3 case badge that you could put somewhere on your case, your car, wherever you would like. I've never seen anybody put it on their car, but who knows, there's always a first for everything. I will not be doing that by the way. Going into the packaging, we do have our heat sink fan combination. So this is a small heat sink. This processor is mainly geared towards people with low end PCs with a budget or small home theater style PCs like mine. So we do have a little bit of pre-applied thermal compound on the, uh, on the base plate here. These four areas screw into the motherboard very securely to keep the processor mounted into place. And here we have our fan. Put that off to the side and let's go ahead and get over to the processor itself. So as I mentioned, this runs the, or excuse me, this uses Intel's LGA1155 socket. This processor is cannot be overclocked. It's not a K-series processor, so that's what that indicates. Here is what the processor looks like on the front, on the top of the little metal piece here. Forgot what that's called actually. It does say that it runs at 3.30 gigahertz was made in Costa Rica, which is pretty interesting. And this is the end that we drop into the motherboard itself. So that was the quick unboxing and overview of the Intel Core i3-3225 processor. Can't wait to start getting this build put together. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this one and move on to the next one. So that is it with this video. If you have any comments, questions, or feedback about this or anything else, feel free to leave those down below in the comments area. But that's it with this video. So thanks a lot for watching and stay tuned for the next video.